Hello there and welcome back to the Achievement Planner and I'm coming to you with Resident Evil 5 DLC Desperate Escape and this is the pacifist version of this. Yes, I'm doing a pacifist run of this DLC. So the rules, no killing unless necessary for story progression, of course. Uh, two, AI partner kills do not count, even though I'm going to take away his weapons. Number three, enemy explosions do not count, so blow each other up, please. And four, amateur difficulty, because, yeah, this is about seeing how many I can avoid, not, you know, how hard it is. Oh, poor, poor Josh. I'm taking all his weapons. <laughs> I'm playing as Jill Valentine. So, yeah, I took Josh's weapons. <laughs> Rude. Okay. So, in this first room, the key I need is either with a guy, or it's in that safe, or it's in the other safe. So, if I check the safes, the safes, yeah, the safes, what the heck? Alright, then I can see whether, alright, come on, come on, Kate, nope. That's a nice gun, though, but nope. So, anyway, let's do this again. So, I, I keep trying to restart, the, <laughs> I keep trying to restart it so I can get the key, because I do not want to kill any of these fellas yep look at that all right i i try i i did uh, go look around and see if i could find it anywhere else but yeah this is what happened to me oh are you kidding me so anyway yeah quit restart take his weapon finally i found the key so it is possible to beat the section without killing any of those enemies the the dozens of enemies that are coming out with you that guy that dude's got a bottle i don't know <laughs> hitting you with the, the other people have like you know Huge weapons, and that guy's got a bottle. All right, use the key. Use the key. Use the. Uh, and then look at this dude. Look, look at my partner. He is the man. Look, look at him. He just like rolled into him. I love that guy. So now, so I, I don't love him enough to not not leave him with this nonsense. Look at him. <laughs> you know what? He can handle himself. This guy, Josh. Well, look at him. Apparently, he has a knife. Apparently, he has it. I don't know. Yeah, <laughs> and oh, I'm on fire. All right, so yeah, it's all. If you if you didn't watch my other passive playthrough, there are a lot of enemies in Resident Evil Five. So why am I shooting this guy? Oh, don't shoot him! Why am I shooting this uh, chainsaw guy? Because he has, he has the um, the key. Yes, he has the key. Uh so, uh, typical. That the chainsaw dude has a key. So, unfortunately, there's my first kill of the game. So, I got the key. Alright. Um, I've never played along with trying to see if I can find a key anywhere else. Because typically when the um, the chainsaw dudes have the key, they have the key. So, uh, alright. Well, whatever. Yeah, there are a lot of enemies here. <clears throat> and they're shooting you with these huge uh, turret things. With, 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 like, rockets. Look at... She is strong, but not strong enough to knock down that door without... <laughs> No, without Josh. Come on, Josh. Let's break this door down. That's right. Yeah, yeah I wouldn't want to fight either of them, let me tell you. Joe Valentine could definitely beat me up. Uh-huh. I guess anybody really could. So, now, the point is, I need to try to get these guns going and shoot the, those doors without the gunner next to it dying. So, yeah, and he's still up here. He's like, why did you just take my gun from me? I don't like you. That's what he said. Wow. Oh my gosh. I did not kill them. Just a note. Here's the second gun. And this guy's like, excuse me? You're not touching this. Gotcha. And I'm like, put get away from me. And then look, look, he just watches me. He's like, all oh, right, I'm not messing with her either. I guess, I guess he's right. <laughs> and, then, and then my AI partner just rolls into him there, into the gun. Oh. I love that dude. It just rolls into you. Yo, move out of my way. So get to the third gun finally. He's like, what do you think you're doing? And I'm like, what do you what's the look like I'm doing? Yep, that's right. Goodbye. So I get in this section. Alright, now, so the goal <laughs> of this section, uh, and by the way, I don't know how many hundreds of guys I just passed. I remember going in that one room. I think they keep spawning over and over if you kill them. Oh, hello, bug. So you gotta get up this ladder in order to open the door. So I'm waiting for Josh to throw me up. This guy's like, why are you just standing there like a fool? I'm like, I do not know. No! Alright. Yeah. 
I'm like, I do not know why I'm standing here waiting for him. So anyway, he throws me out there. He's over here trying to get through. <laughs> Look at her. She is so strong. All right. Yes, I mean everybody's made to look stronger in Resident Evil 5 and 6, but but honestly, I think they are. I think Joe Valentine is that strong. So we get to the last section, and I honestly said to myself, you know what? I don't know if this is going to happen because you are waiting for five minutes for a helicopter to get here and save you, and you have I don't know how many of these guys just getting dropped in and attacking you. So my goal was, oh, and don't forget, my partner can die, which is extremely annoying. To be honest, if Josh, my partner, couldn't die, this wouldn't have been as hard as it Yeah, hello. This wouldn't have been as hard as it, 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 it turned out to be. <sighs> because if he died, I had to go save him. So anyway, just got to keep running. Just got to keep running. And you can see Josh is... Oh, yes, that's my boy right there. I love that guy. He is... I think he might be my favorite uh, AI partner of all time. In fact, I want to replay this as him. Because you can choose characters. He's dying. You know, that's not his fault. Look at how many guys were... That guy's got a spiked bat. Are you kidding me? Alright, so I get down to 43 seconds. 42 seconds. 41 seconds. 40 seconds. Yeah, and then the idiot in the helicopter is... is adds time. Oh... <laughs> Anyway, it's functional. We get it. You know, 51 seconds. Yeah, you are. You see what he just did? He just rolled into the... He hit me with the gun. First of all, Josh just rolled into the dude and <laughs> blew up his head with his knee. Second of all, that dude just hit me with his huge gun. Oh, man. All right, so here we are. That, that's glitching out. Get out of here. We got down to 14, 13, 12. What do you think? Can I do it? <laughs> I guess you figured out at this point that I probably did it without killing a single enemy in this section. And I, I'm just looking at it almost like sh shocked, like I did it. Man. And uh, that chainsaw dude, the one kill. Anyway, that's it for that. I hope you enjoyed that. I'll see you next time on Achievement Planner.